Hey everyone, how's it going? So I want to share with you the ECCB Air Conduct Chair. And we actually went through two Air Conduct Chair made out of lumber before. They only last for about a year and a half to two before it start getting brittle and and the wood start deteriorating. Even though we put additional coating on to protect it, uh, we usually leave it out in the element here in the west coast. So lots of sun, no snow, but you get somewhat rain um, during the winter months and the rain and the sun definitely put a toll on the previous anaconda chair. Uh, so th these are again from ECCB and we discovered this in the Midwest uh, during our stay in one of those tiny homes and if it's able to withstand those elements snow uh, salt rain um, and the heat during the summer uh, we think that you know this this brand could be given a, a chance to see how long it lasts uh, we're not going to cover these although it is foldable you actually can fold these up uh, and then store them away for the winter months and i do recommend that um, but it's out in the open here. So these are brand new and they're very heavy. I, I would say maybe 70, 80 pounds. And the difference with this anaconda chair is if it's residential area um, for purchase, it's actually lifetime limit warranty. So if any of these breaks, the manufacturer will cover this. And this is made in the USA. Um, I, I heard that is uh, the, the fake lumber is manufactured in Texas and then shipped to Pennsylvania for assembly or cutting and, and doing all the, the slab here. These actually have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven slab. Normally I would see maybe four or five slab. Usually five slab is your typical for the back. And there's a lot more for the seat rest here too. This is the deluxe version. Um, they either um, non-deluxe or deluxe. The deluxe has this wine holder and your phone holder, as well as a cup holder. So it's pretty neat. But what's hidden here, and you probably don't see it, is a leg rest. So this actually has a leg rest with additional leg support. If you want to leave it higher. And I think it's pretty neat. So we're pretty happy with how the quality is on this anaconic chair. And again, this is not real wood. This is called some kind of flux wood. It feels more like plastic, but there's supposed to be some fake wood material that they manufacture and this is all recyclable okay they use recyclable material for this so we have four and this is the orange color they actually come in like 15 to 20 different colors and you can also do a mix and match you can actually do for the leg stand a different color versus the slap as well as the hand rest so you can do contrast um, it does cost about $20 more per chair when you do that. But some people prefer just one color of the entire chair. But if you want to stand out a little bit, they do come in um, different color, variety of color. Up to 20, I believe, in total. So lots of color to choose from. There's a wood texture version that actually looks like real wood. Um, but we didn't want it to blend too much with a decorative wall on the back here. So we thought that, you know, having more of a front bright color will stand out. And let me fold. So to fold this, it's pretty simple. You actually, so I just assemble this. So you just tilt the back forward like this. And 
again, it's pretty heavy. show you how thin it is once you fold it well not too thin but maybe about six inches six to eight inches and you can fold all the chair up to store it away if you're living in harsh climate but you know we'll, we'll see how long it lasts it's lifetime warranty if it's residential so we're not too concerned about it being damaged because we can easily just call the manufacturer and have them send us replacement parts so they only will send you replacement parts unless it's a total failure then they'll send you a new chair but it's just their discretion um but what they explained to me is they never had much of an issue with having to replace the whole chair uh, usually it's either one or two that breaks off um, due to when they were screwing in uh, those, uh, those stainless steel screw nuts and bolts and those are stainless steel so they won't rust so I'll post a link where you can find these chair and I highly recommend it because all the chairs all the other kind of chairs that we went through um haven't last and they also stain if you get the wood stain um version you can see there's still some left over there and we can't get that out um, but these should not stain uh, the color they said that three four years you might see some slight fading but the whole thing is dyed it's just not this is not painted outside so the whole inside out is this color okay so if you sand this down for whatever reason you want to sand it down it's the same color inside then th these you can tuck away again you can tuck these away same thing with the leg rests Yeah, I'm um, getting ready for spring summer. Remember to subscribe. Catch you all next time.